Hey, hello everybody, welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. We're back playing as Ulam. <laughs> Once again, uh, here's the seed 2Q6P7ANW. We're back playing as the man, the myth, and the freaking legend Ulam. Or Ulam. Ulami. Salami. I don't know. All I know is this is a mod by Mad Dogs. Uh, who also created the Silas mod, which I forgot to mention. And he also has some other mods that we will probably end up playing in the future because I like this guy's style. Anyway, for those of you that didn't see the last episode and are wondering, uh, Tyler, uh, this is a two-part mod video? What happened? Uh, you go back, you watch that, uh, first video. And you, you enjoy it, frankly, because it, it was, it was an experience to be had, I believe, is the correct word to say here. I'm hoping... This run goes slightly better. We get some dope synergies. Uh, and we make it past the third floor. <laughs> That's the plan. Uh, because I really struggled with that in the uh, previous video. So I did look up a little bit more on this character. Uh, and the special tiers are granted through different items. So we kind of just got to experiment around and see what we can get uh, from this guy. And there's a bunch of different synergies to be had. So... What does that mean for you? It means that we will be traversing our way through what we call the Binding of Isaac and seeing what we can see with the uh, Ulam and hopefully getting some cool center. Apparently this room uh, just decides to put all of the HUDs right in the middle of the screen. Uh, this is probably a bug, uh, is what I'm going to say about this. Uh, and it is obstructing my view a little bit, but you know what? Uh, we'll persevere, because we are Ulam the Great and the Powerful. This is going to be a Weekend at Bernie situation all over again. Ulam is our new Lord and Savior. Alright, let's back to the top. Let's go back and find our item room. Item room could contain a uh, freaking mom's knife, which I have no idea what that would do with this. Or it's going to contain Linger Bean, in which case we do know what it does with it, uh, and it's not anything that I'm going to get super hyped about. We get a battery charge. Battery charge completely worthless right now. Dry baby, I do enjoy. I'm never going to say no to a dry baby. I'm also going to pop in here and find there is nothing to be had. Uh, I should not hold down my fire when... It's a very hard thing to get used to, but you shouldn't hold down your fire when leaving a room here. Because it's just going to shoot one right in the next room. Hello, HUD. How are you? Let's do this crap. Uh, it's the haunt. Apparently, all you do uh, when you play as Ulam is fight the haunt. I've experienced this on numerous occasions now. I would love it if the haunt children would smack my ghost baby right into the middle of the next century. So that he can activate and do a nice black heart's worth of damage to our enemies. But apparently he will just uh, do that on his own sometime soon. Please, Dry Baby, if you're really feeling like it. I would love it if you did. You know what I would also love? I love Magic Mush from this fight. Give me that nice damage boost to start. That did kind of sound like damage boobs. Completely different. Trust me. Uh, and this fight is going swimmingly. I'm playing slightly better. Uh, and you're probably like Tyler. If this is slightly better, Pentagram is actually dope here. Uh, if this is slightly better, then you must have played really bad on that last run. And the answer is, yes, I played Jack Crap Horrible. Not to be confused with Jack Black Horrible, which is a completely different kind of horrible that centers itself around Jack Black's role in the hit movie. Uh, what was that one movie he was in? School of Rock? In which case he was deemed as a pedophile. It's an unfortunate uh, ending for him, but what you gonna do, I suppose. We get the virus, uh, which gives us now the poison tears, which I'm not gonna complain about. It's it's a tear effect. Is it the best one? I'm gonna go with no. Uh, at least I hope not. I, I clearly don't know what the other effects are quite yet, but I'm hoping that we can get something uh, that really knocks my socks off somewhere on this run. And right now, uh, I'm not going to give you any video proof, but my socks are definitely still on. So, we'll see what happens in the near future, but I'm just waiting for them to get knocked off. Because I think this character has a lot of potential, and this style 
has a lot of potential with the ammo based uh system i just want to see what all it can do now this is where we could definitely lose our deal with the devil chance is a room like this because these guys can be nasty but we're gonna do our best and we're also gonna put on a bad southern accent while we do it okay item room feeling it mm, no we're not item room is probably not going to be this direction yeah this is just carry on my wayward son there will be no deal with the devil chance where you are gone that's unfortunate uh what's the plan now then i think you go back and you find the item room first i think you also check out the shop uh this shop sucks frankly i mean it's it's a good shop there's good items in it but this shop so i mean it's also a good shop because it has a luck upgrade in it and a lucky penny in it and please for the love of god no there we go thank you you're a gentleman and a scholar uh what do you do here judgment what do you do here we can't place bombs i wish this guy could place bombs man why no bombs judgment it's a it's a regular guy i want diplopia but frankly i want this spirit heart more we're not going to get enough money to make that uh work i'm fairly positive of it also, I have no idea what all exploded just in there when we started, but I'm going to be accepting of it and move on. We have a 46% chance at a deal with the devil, uh, and that's all due to Pentagram. And I'm, I'm super content with it. You know, we don't deserve a deal with the devil on this floor in the slightest. Uh, but if the game wants to be a doll, you let it. I mean, that's, that's my motto. Crystal Ball's actually dope. Because this will be renewable HP for us now. We can see secret rooms, but there's really no way of us getting into them, is there? Can we shoot our way into secret rooms? No. And we can't place bombs. So I guess secret rooms are just a non-factor uh, when playing as this guy. Which does make him significantly harder as a character. You know, I'm still waiting to see where this guy becomes overly powerful. Now, obviously, piercing shots to start is pretty good, uh, but the limited number of shots, this is not an easy character to play as, and maybe I should not have, I mean, I played, like, super freaking horrible on the last run, but maybe I shouldn't have judged myself so horribly. We did not get a deal with the devil. We don't deserve one, and I didn't want one. I want to prove myself. My phone is buzzing, but that's okay. Life will go on. Caves XL. This is where things could get nasty. If we don't get a deal with the devil here, uh, then we are going to be in a bad spot. Luckily, Crystal Ball is going to give us mapping of this floor, uh, and we're going to be able to move significantly faster throughout this. That was the stupidest damage I've ever taken in my life. But we will be able to see exactly where we're going here shortly. Uh, once again, thank you for just the pitiful damage on my part. But we can basically hightail it to the boss if we want to try our best to not uh, lose our deal with the devil chance. That might be the way to do this, honestly. I like the idea of having the arrows one shot. But I know that you can't do that for everything. I am going to pop this. Was that the smart idea? That was not the smartest idea. No. Uh, okay, that was a little sketch. Beautiful. That worked well. Alges. Alges could guarantee our deal with the devil. As long as we make our way into the room. Okay. Tyler's scared. Tyler's had too much. Okay. We're fine. We're going to get a charge here. It's going to give us a... Oh, you son of a gun. There it is. Okay. I was going to say, you better freaking not uh, give me... A card instead of a spirit heart here. So now we know where we're going. Uh, and the, the direction is down. We're going down, down. Something, something. Sugar, we're going down swinging. I still don't know the lyric to that song. Someday, man. Someday. Someday. We can add that one to the, like, top ten list of songs to have sex to. Because it's definitely, like, Africa by Toto's up there. Down Under by the Men in Hats. And then someday by uh, 
God, what the hell is the name of that guy? I vaguely remember it. Somebody help me out. Who's someday by? I don't even know if that's... When I get older, I will be stronger. That's not the right song either. Someday... Wait. My, my mind is being flooded by bad 80s songs right now. Ghost Baby. Oh, we got the whole gang. Ghost Baby's here. Dry Baby's here. The gang's all here. All we need now is a deal with the devil that contains, like, I don't know, Rotten Baby. Give me the conjoined transformation. Sign me up. Uh, anything. Anything, anything, anything. Anything you can do, I can do slightly worse because I'm bad. What do we got in here? It's okay. But I don't think we want it. That's literally the biggest joke of the planet. Uh, that is really bad. Poison tears we already have, man. So I'm going to roll with none of those. And hope we can get another reroll here. Because those are all like pretty inconsequential to our run. Doesn't hurt our run in any way, but they don't really do anything. I'm hoping for money from you. you. Gave me a lot of hearts. But you did give me money. I didn't see the nickel at first. Let's come back in here, continue to crank these rerolls. The Ankh, it just ruins the point of the run. And you give me freaking Stompy. I'm gonna take it. Uh, and my reasoning is we can now crack into Tinted Rocks uh, with ease. But I'm not exactly happy with this pickup. I think that it could have been uh, much... I have figured out how bombs work. It took me a while. I place the bomb. It attaches itself to the tier. And then I fire it. That is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay. Well, now we know that like bombs are totally valuable. And I should not have taken Stompy at all. Uh, and we can fire explosive shots with bombs. This is just like the whole new world. Call up Aladdin. A whole new world. That's where I'll be, man. What we got in here? Buy a spirit heart. I wouldn't have minded picking up uh, Mom's key, but a spirit heart is also significantly nicer. Okay, so now let's just test my theory. Boom, attach the bomb, fire it in. I wish I would have known it sooner, boys. I wish I would have known it sooner. And, and women. Boys and women. I'm not being sexist here. Okay, we got a 100% chance of a deal with the devil. That's really good. Part of me is incredibly tempted to just crank High Priestess on this guy, but I don't think that's a smart idea. The next guy is probably going to be like the freaking peep, and that's the guy you want to pop High Priestess on. Correct? I'm not the only one that believes that. Okay, this version of Forsaken is annoying to say the least, uh, but he's beatable, and we're going to be beating him right now. Oh my god, you son of a gun. I Sign me up for dodge of the year right there. I, how have I not gotten hit in this room? Frankly, uh, give me a medal, because I deserve it. Okay, grab our arrows, and then hop in here. It's Gertie. Thank god that you actually attacked Gertie, and you didn't attack one of the little things in the corner. This fight is going to go swimmingly. Our deal with the devil is ours. Uh, and hopefully it's going to contain some kind of dope synergy. I still want to see what brimstone arrows look like. Because if they aren't actually anything cool, Tyler's going to be kind of sad. Like if it literally just replaces our run with brimstone, uh, I'm hitting the restart. We get a tiers upgrade. I think that that's a good thing. And deal with the devil... If you could see my face right now, you would know just how happy I am. Uh, Juicy Shadow, we don't want to die and turn into somebody else. But Brimstone, hell yeah, boys. Yeah. No, that is exactly what I wanted to see. Okay. Well, sign me up. This run, uh, I'm not going to put it as a win. But I am going to put it as in the dope AF category. Th this is what one would consider as dope AF. We now have... Uh, now, I want to study how this actually works, and the answer is, Tyler has no idea. It seems to be fairly random, like a Monstro's Lung type uh, thing. Yeah, it seems like wherever it lands, 
as just shooting up a brim from an angle. I don't really understand, but I still am in love. Like, that one swimmingly. That did not, but that was just my own stupid doing. I don't know. Th this is cool. If you don't find this cool, uh, you don't like NBA basketball. But if you don't find this uh, cool, seriously, what the hell is wrong with you? My main man, this is dope. We got, we're firing brim arrows. And all of a sudden, I'm sitting here looking like a fool with my pants on the ground because I didn't, uh, oh, a joker card. Don't mind if I freaking do, buddy. Uh, but I'm looking like a fool because I have played like crap with this character. Oh, you gave me technology too. And uh, not technology too, but technology as well. I actually don't think it does anything though. So that's a little bit disappointing. I'm actually kind of saddened by it, but I'm still very much so happy with the current situation. Apply that bomb and fire it away, boys. Also crank that, get a spirit heart. Take one step and rewind it back. The Ulam's got the various elements to make the booty go smack. Alright, apply that. Boom. Apply it again. Boom. We're booming out here, boys. Uh, Joker card is awesome, like I said various minutes ago. Uh, and if we don't get a deal with the devil on this floor, we will be popping it. We're now, after all was said and done, we're in a situation where boss rush is totally a possibility for us. Uh, and that is great. We're going to take this. It's portable slot. We're going to not take that. And so we're just going to move on. HP is looking fine. Uh, damage, obviously, is looking okay. I wouldn't mind more damage upgrades, but I'm not going to sit here and beg you for them. You've given me a beautiful gift. What this gift is, I haven't quite fully understood it yet, but it's a gift nonetheless. Let's do this. Mask of Infamy. You should go down pretty easy if we just can attach a brim shot to you. Yeah, just like that. And then you, you want to do the same? I kind It's like we have random Tammy's head, but we continue to shoot it, like, all the time. We did get a deal. We also got dessert. There's big bells going off on my campus. Uh, we will take this. It's my shadow. In case you didn't know, my shadow sucks. Uh, and then we will take our spirit heart. We should have saved that for the next floor, so we got mapping, but screw it. Let's head down. And now it's just a matter of, you know, can we make it to the boss rush and steal as an item from as a boss rush? Or just do boss rush, but I'm not really feeling that. Because we have the Joker card, uh, we can teleport out. And I would happily do it as well. I would like, like, some more tiers. Like, the ability to fire more arrows and not pick up a bunch. Our tier stat is low now because of picking up Brimstone. So, that's okay. That's something that I'm willing to do. If you can hear these bells in the background, put hashtag bells in the chat. Because they are loud AF here. Is that what the cool kids... Do, are, do, are the cool kids still saying AF or did that, did that fade? Did we give them the fade? I try to be hip with the times, yo. I say that as if I'm not an 18-year-old in a university who is about as hip with... The, I'm, at, I'm not hip with the times at all. Metronome, not good. We're going to stick with Crystal Ball. Metronome could be cool to see some synergies, but I don't necessarily care right now. So please show me the way uh, to the boss... And it's going to be close on boss rush. I actually don't think we will end up getting it. But don't let your dreams be memes. I'm going to try my hardest. Because I think boss rush has value here. But I also know that we are in a position where it doesn't really seem possible for us to make boss rush. We'd have to beat this floor pretty quickly now. And just beating Mom seems fairly difficult given our current setup. 
You know, we're powerful, but we're not quick powerful. And this is a character that if he were to be implemented into the real game, which I'm, I'm not saying he won't be, I just don't think it would because I don't think they're ever going to add characters. Uh, this would be a guy where the post-it notes would suck for him, you know? It'd be a fun character to play if you were just playing a character, but completing the post-its, I don't know, man. You know, doing Delirium with this guy, don't sign me up, because I don't really want to do that. You know, beating Hush with only shooting arrows. That sounds painful. Sun card. I mean, just pop it, and then Dry Baby procs, and then you cheat your way through the system by putting down a bomb right there, and then you do it again right here. And then you actually have a chance to make it to boss rush. Okay. Sure. Did we re-pick up the Joker card? Or did I just forget it? I'm going to be really sad if I forgot it. I think I forgot it. Somebody's going to be very upset with me after this video is over. Okay. We are in a weird spot where we're not really doing the damage that I would like to be doing during this fight. Because, like, Mom won't get in the way of Brim lasers. That's gonna do it. No deal with the devil. There's Boss Rush. Uh, for those of you that are wondering why I can't see... Oh, we do have the Joker card. I had a weird thing covering it up. So come in here. Uh, take an item that we don't have to do anything with. Nod Leaf, sure. And then come in here and take both. Contract from below. Satanic Bible. Both pretty okay items. Head down to the next floor. We're going to win this run, I think. I, I put the disclaimer of I think on there because time will tell whether or not I actually do. But we have what we need to, I think. I don't know, man. We'll see. I'm going to take a little brim. I like the idea of having many numerous brim type related things now. If you want to give me... Uh, uh, what what else brim related items are there? None. Give me some random new item that you added in the mod, called brim brim bow for brim arrow, or brim rainbow. I don't know. Okay. Uh, crystal ball. Pop it. Where are we going? We're going down, down, down. And we will be going down, 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 for the rest of this run. Except we actually won't. We'll be going up to the cathedral soon. But you catch my drift. Uh, why did I decide to do that? That's a really good question. I don't really know. And our HP is now not looking incredible. Uh, but I'm still not really concerned. Yet. I, I put the disclaimer of yet on there. Because it's going to be very easy to get concerned here soon. I wish we had a... Re like, very renewable way to get battery charges right now that didn't involve going to every room. You know, like, sack head or something would be dope. Are we gonna do the hush fight? Uh, that's a hilarious joke. The answer to that is no. I, I honestly, I would, but I don't think that I can actually, like, beat hush. I think that I would die. And I don't think that this run ending with a death is the way that I want it to end. And I hope you accept that. You know, I know you guys want to see me do stupid stuff, but I've already, like, botched this mod once. To botch it again would just be, that's just mean on my part. Why did I go into this room? You know what? Chuck, chuck a bomb at that door. And then we are going to come back up here and grab both of these bombs. Just going to, like, kite this bomb around. Good talk. Yeah, you know what? This is a great room to just pop. Wow, we still got hit, though. It's a little bit frustrating right now. We're not doing, like, as much damage as I thought we would be doing. Am I, like, in the wrong for saying I mean, our damage is only 5.94. That's not exactly, uh, in terms of Isaac damage, anything that one would consider killing it. It's Brimstone that's making us look good. One makes you larger is incredibly stupid to take again. Oh, and now we're sitting in an odd situation, aren't we? Okay. Well, we're a hit away from death. Do you think you got a super secret room right there? How about down here? I kind of want to find it, man. Oh, no. Okay. Good talk. How about right there? That is right there. Eternal heart. 
It's definitely odd. Uh, didn't really expect that. Conquest. I died. I actually died. Well, Ulam has bested me. Uh, and... I blame myself for the majority of this situation. Uh, and the other half, I blame just life in general. Uh, that's the Ulam mod. If you want to check it out, play it. You can find a link in the description down below to the mod. It is a ton of fun. Uh, apparently, I'm just really bad at him. A and that, I accept. I'm hot garbage. Hottie G right here. Thanks so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed, be sure to leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.